<laughs> Hello and welcome to my closet. Well, we're kind of outside. <coughs> I decided um, I need to organize my closet because it has just gotten out of hand. This video is I feel like it's gonna be kind of exposing to me and like how long I've had certain pieces of clothing clothing <gasps> closing that too you can go back and see the date in 2015 that I had pieces of these clothing and you'll be like hmm why do you still own that and I'll be like because I don't buy a lot of new clothes. I'm not much of a clothes buyer. And I find like things that I really like and then wear them a lot. I don't know what people consider a lot of clothes, but I think this is like, it's too much for me. I'm pretty minimalist when it comes to most things, but for some reason I hold on to clothes. I'm one of those people that's like, I'll wear that later never wears it wears it once and then never wears it again i went through a phase for a few years where all i bought was just like trendy things that like i thought were really cute at the time and then like two months later i'm like <gasps> and we'll get into that but yeah let's just get started y'all don't like all these long intros come on I think we're good in the shoe department. I don't think I need to get rid of any of these. I have two pairs of Doc Martens. Worn them maybe once. They look so big on my feet. My feet are already big and they just, I don't know. Maybe I will wear them in the, see that's what I do. Look at my sock drawer. Hello? Yeah, it's just kind of random and you don't want to see me organize my sock drawer. And then we have swimsuits. I don't want to go through my swimsuits, but I need to. I went on a Shein. Don't say it. And I bought all these designs like, I bought these swimsuits and I'm like it's cute and I love dinosaurs but I don't think I can do it I don't it's so hard for me to get rid of clothes like this is gonna be the saddest thing you've ever seen okay we'll get rid of the dinosaurs I'm sorry girly I'm so sorry maybe I'll find another dinosaur swimsuit someday but not today this Completely see-through, never wore it. I think I'll keep this top. I really like the cloud ones. I'm still in my cloud era. Okay, I've spent 28 billion minutes doing this, but now it all fits if you really, truly cram it in there into one drawer. Wow. It closed, it closed. Just a Shein graveyard. Oh, and I have these glasses on for the sole reason of just looking at clothes and being like. Hmm. This is the big boy right here. Just all of these clothes that are hung up. I completely ran out of hangers, don't have any more hangers, and that means mads, mads. Get rid of some cards. Let's just take out a few of these. Oh my god, see I ran out of hangers and I'm like. <laughs> I do like this shirt from Gap. I wore this for a Bob Ross video, I believe got paint on it for that reason i'm out and it's brown paint if it was like a cute paint look like i'm so sorry. like it hurts my heart like my heart just sunk right then 
I've had this for so long though, but why has she been around is the question. Like, there's a reason. Okay, for right now, we'll keep it. <laughs> no. Plain tank top that I wear all the time under stuff. We gotta keep that one. This shirt. This is a Forever 21 purchase. Where will I wear this? I'm gonna definitely keep that one. <laughs> Every piece of clothing that I've worn in a video, I'm like, I have to keep it because I wore it in a video. Madison, you made like 500 videos. Like, stop. Oh, we all know what phase this shirt is. Oh, this is kind of sad, but I still kept the cloud swimsuit. This was one of my. Oh, this is so, this is so cute. This is so cute. But then wore it once and was like, <laughs> I think I'm going to finish going through all of this. And then I like come back and kind of update you as to where I am. The camera said we're not focusing on that. So I have made some progress. There's a huge pile of clothes over there. And I'm like. Good job. I have to keep this. This is my baseball tee. I got rid of the Troy Bolton baseball tee because I was like, okay, we don't need 800 baseball tees. It was weird because like a big reason why I got rid of certain items of clothing was because it had a ba bad memory attached to it. And not to get all Emily Mariko on you guys, but I feel like it's gonna help. I love this cardigan and I always forget to wear it. It's like cute little, just like, Cardi, Cardi B. This is a free people top, so we automatically have to keep this to look rich. Maybe I'll just become a brand new person after I get rid of all these clothes. Like, I hope so. I got this from Target, never wore it. I still think it's cute. Beach Boys and like the back is like, if the wind's blowing, you're like, oh, there's my back, mole. We'll just keep both. Why not? I'm acting like I'm gonna just like live in regret if I get rid of one gray t-shirt. This shirt doesn't do well on camera. Can't keep it. Uh, uh, uh. Is we the free, free people? <laughs> We have made more progress. Work in progress. I should put like a sign on here that says work in progress. Like one of those metal yellow signs. I've done all this. It doesn't look like much has gone, but the pile. I really want to keep this. I don't know. I never know how to wear them, but I think this shirt is so cool though. It's a Wrangler. Got it at a thrift store. It was a thrift find. Maybe I'll become sophisticated. I feel like button up shirts are like grown up and sophisticated. And I got rid of a lot of like my teen clothes. So maybe I'll be more sophisticated. This is from my Ross costume. And it took me so long to find this. And I'm like, I can't get rid of it. You know, if I had someone to give it to, I'd give it to them. But what if I just feel like dressing up like Ross one day? I'm gonna keep it. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, you know how people are like, well, if you haven't worn it in like a year, get rid of it. But the thing is with me, I'm like, oh, I actually literally forgot I had this. And that's why I didn't wear it for a year. But then I'm like, would I have remembered if I really wanted to? This is my... Bella costume jacket, and I'm gonna keep it. Okay, we actually have some spare, some spare room. Spare room. I had zero hangers. Now I have those hangers and those hangers. Look at that giant pile. This is good. This is good. I have 
I have like all of these piles of hoodies and sweatshirts. This is all of them. Yeah, I can reach it. I can like go through and I kind of pick it up. Sometimes they all fall over and it makes me really frustrated and mad. But it's the best way for right now for me. I probably won't get rid of many of these. But I kind of want to uh, organize them into pajama sweatshirts like some of them I specifically wear like for pajamas and then like wearing out sweatshirts and hoodies um okay may not wanting to move this because it's just gonna come crumbling down there we go this hoodie has been through it. I had a red one just like this and it had, oh, it's still here. Cash slinging slasher. My favorite Spongebob episode of all time. I usually just wear it around like Halloween because I don't want to spook people. They may get spooked. This Vans hoodie, I still really like this. It has like a little butterfly on it. Always in my butterfly era. Okay, I'm gonna go through the rest, these two and Kind of like put the rest up. I don't think y'all want to see that. Okay, so we have a little more room to work with. Looks good. I was done like stacking these up and I was like, alright, so pants and then that's it. T-shirts. Ireland! still have quite a few quite a few but I think it's better got rid of you know a lot of t-shirts <coughs> anyway the dust is <clears throat> not a must let's go to my dresser So I have all of these drawers. It's all pants. Denim shorts, workout shorts plus skirts. This one is like uh, jeans, lots of jeans and some pants. More jeans and pants. Look at that folding, guys. I'm living my Emily Mariko life right now. And then uh, some pajama pants. <laughs> I posted something on my Instagram story like, who never told me American Eagle had really cute jeans? And what I meant by that was like, I haven't worn American Eagle jeans since approximately middle school. And I didn't know that they had like updated cute jeans was what I meant. And someone replied and was like, this is the most homeschool thing I have ever heard. <laughs> I was like, these pants I bought at Urban Outfitters, or like I ordered them, ordering jeans. Absolutely not. They are too small for me. And I think they're so cute, but unfortunately, I just have to get rid of them because they literally do not fit. So I don't know why I kept them. I'm like, maybe I can wear them sometime. Girl, they don't fit. Like, I don't get it. Oh, man. These are some American Eagle jeans. I can't do it. I can't do these jeans anymore. They're like so tight and they fit like jeggings basically. I just can't do it. I can't do it. These are my like super baggy jeans that I love. Um, but these are like low cut boot cut and I have to have one pair. I have to have one pair of them. This pair. Gotta have one pair of basketball shorts at all times. 
Shorts time. Let's see. I don't think I'll be getting rid of like many pairs of shorts. Okay, these are way too small. Don't know why I kept those. Like I just don't think I wear this skirt. And I bought it for a video. Never return. This was from like a thrift flip video. And I kept them because I was like, they'll be cute one day. I don't think that day will ever come. I ordered these and they're like, girl, your buttocks. These? I love these. Don't know where to wear them. Yes, hopefully you've like enjoyed doing this. It's been probably a little more serious. <laughs> that was silly though, that part was silly. It's been a little bit more serious, but this is a real life video. This is like me IRL, like trying to fix something in my real life to like actually help me in real life. So. Um, if you'd like more videos like this where I like try to actually get my life together, that could be a fun series. Clean something else. Try to like do my dishes. You want a video of me doing my dishes? Didn't think so. Don't ask what time it is. Don't. We came to a little roadblock and then we like stayed at that roadblock and like it didn't try to fix it but okay so look at this immaculate i had all the same hangers for this i like spaced them out all evenly and then here of course i ran out of the fancy hangers but you know there's a lot less than there was there's still so much though see i don't know why i did that Hopefully this will inspire you to go through your closet and clean it out a little bit. Progress is better than nothing at all. Just wait for when I actually go through all the clothes and fold them and everything and then I get really attached to it and like, oh no, I should have kept this. Thanks for cleaning out my closet with me. I t-shirts and I don't know what to do with them.